New details are emerging about a fire in the town of Triangle that left a three-year-old girl and her father dead. Police say it was the father who set the blaze in a tragic case of domestic violence. Police are calling the fire that incinerated this town of Triangle home Saturday night a murder-suicide. Police say 61-year-old Larry Oney shot his three-year-old daughter Allison while setting their house on fire, then shot himself in the head. All to get revenge on his 39-year-old wife, Melissa Oney, who police say told her husband earlier that day she wanted a divorce. Yeah, that was part of his torture to her, to tell her how he was going to kill the daughter and uh, himself and, and burn the house down. And she could watch and remember it for the rest of her life. Police say Larry Oney originally threatened to kill his wife before deciding he would instead bound her and put her in a car to watch him exact his revenge. Larry Oney sliced Melissa Oney's Achilles tendon to prevent her escape, police say, but she was able to free herself enough to call 911 on her cell phone and flag down help. The deputies, upon responding, were advised that uh, there was a subject in his house uh, with a gun that was going to kill the daughter and burn the house down. Broome County Sheriff's deputies tried to enter the house to save the child, but the house was engulfed beyond entry. The fire also set off to unused ammunition in the house. Rounds were going off as the house was burning. They thought maybe the subject inside or in that area was shooting at them. Larry Oney was a pilot, and police had the Greater Binghamton Airport lock down his plane in case Oney tried to use it to flee the area. That was before they discovered the bodies of Larry and Allison Oney beneath the rubble. Melissa Oney is at Wilson Hospital and is expected to recover from her injuries after surgery Saturday night.